Alyssa and Anthony Apodaca's lives changed forever. I don't really remember much other than just being scared about the baby. When Bernalillo County deputies say this man, Sean Rigdon, slammed into their car last year. He hit us so hard, so fast, with no break. He didn't break or nothing. Alyssa was five months pregnant and forced into early labor. Her son, Messiah, was stillborn. Been a hard year. Deputies say Rigdon's blood alcohol level was three times the legal limit, and yet 14 months later, Rigdon still is not facing any charges. And now Action 7 News has learned that Rigdon has a history of drunk driving. Rigdon's driving records show his license was revoked three times between 1994 and 1999 for either a DWI conviction or refusing to take sobriety tests when arrested. But he got his license back every time, and deputies say it was valid during during last year's crash. As for why he hasn't formally been charged, the district attorney's office says it's waiting on medical records before it can proceed. It has up to five years from the date of the crash to file charges. The Apodacas certainly hope it doesn't take that long. In Albuquerque, Megan Cruz, KOAT Action 7 News. A lot of